Hi guys, so as you can see by the title of today's video, it's going to be a Boohoo loungewear haul and I've got so many cute little things I can't wait to show you and if you do enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also, please subscribe to me, it would mean the absolute world and I'm just going to get right in. So this is the first item, it's this gorgeous like light neon yellow colour and it's got really nice pleats all the way around which I think is so cute and also it's got this ruched detail all down the sides, all up the back down the front and it's also got a really nice neckline as well i think it's like a really nice subtle v it's not like a really pointy v it's just like really nice on a t-shirt also the material of this t-shirt is such good quality it's like a thick t-shirt cotton material and i don't think your nips would show for it but just for the sake of this video i am wearing a bra underneath when i go out probably won't be wearing a bra but for the sake of you guys i'm just going to be wearing a bra so you can't see anything you know don't want a nip slip and yeah, I'm obsessed. I think this is gorgeous. I think it's so cute. And I think it'll go really well with the joggers that I have to show you next. So I'm not really keen on the joggers because one, they're a completely different shade of yellow, which was really hard to tell on the website. And two, you can see the pockets through them. I don't know if you can see this on camera, but it's just, it's not a good look. It just, it just looks cheap. And they're not even like, they haven't got that thick, fluffy material on the inside they're a bit yeah like they just feel a bit cheap and they don't really cuff tight on the bottom it's like really baggy so yeah i don't really know what else to say about these and also this is fake this is not a drawstring so oh and also you can see manicures and you can see the tag so yeah wouldn't recommend these joggers i'm sure they do have other nice quality joggers on the website but I just picked the wrong ones. So these joggers are the next item and they are much better quality than the last pair. They've got that gorgeous soft feeling material on the inside and they are nicely cuffed on the ankles. But I am still having that same problem as I did with the other ones where you can see the pockets and I'm just not keen on that look. So yeah, I don't know what's going on there. I don't know if it's just the two pairs I've picked or if like all their joggers are like this because I've never really tried the joggers from Boohoo before, so let me know if they do actually do some good joggers that don't have the pockets showing. But, oh, I'm so disappointed, because I just thought these would be so cute with the top that I've got next. Like, I thought they'd look so cute together. So I'll show you the top, and hopefully, fingers crossed, that one will be a good one. So this is the top that I've got to go with these joggers, and it's gorgeous looking, and, I love the shape of the neck, I love that it's like a waffle material, but it's just too see-through, like I'm wearing my nude bra and you can see it, like I don't I don't think you can see it on camera, I'm not sure, but yeah you can see it and it's just, it's not a good look, it's just, it's way too see-through and oh I'm so sad, I feel like it just looks so cute. Now if this wasn't see-through, this would have been an absolute keeper because I just, like I said, I love the waffle material. I love the shape, I love the way the collar sort of like hangs to the side, but yeah, it's, it's gonna have to go back, it's just way too see-through. So I just realised that this is a set, like I didn't see it when I was pulling it out of the bag, but it comes with a pair of shorts, so that's made it a little bit better, I mean, I guess you could wear it as like a bikini cover-up if you wanted to, like, I feel like it does have potential to be a bikini cover-up, but... It is very see-through, so I think that's the only thing I could possibly wear this with and get away with it, is a bikini cover-up. But yeah, I mean, I guess if you're just going to wear this at home, then it doesn't really matter that it's see-through. For me, I like to be able to wear it at home and when I go out as well, so yeah, I'm going to have to send this one back. So this next item is from the men's section on Boohoo, and it is so silky soft on the inside, and I love this shade of pink, I think it's gorgeous. And it fits really well, like it is a size small in the men's and I am really glad that I got a size small because it would have been too big if I'd have got a medium. And yeah, I think it's so cute. And also, today is absolutely roasting and I cannot believe I'm stood here in a fluffy sweatshirt. So I'm going to move on really quick. So this next item is this gorgeous red oversized t-shirt with NASA on the front. And I just think it looks so cute with some cycling shorts and a pair of black Doc Martens or like black biker boots or something. And I just think you're good to go. It's just an easy throw on outfit and it's super comfy, super cash. I just think it's such a great piece. 
and I'm in love with this shade of red. I think this is such a nice colour. I think it goes with so many different skin tones, so many different hair colours. And yeah, I just think it's such a great oversized t-shirt. So the next items are these two together. It comes as a set and I got it on the men's section in Boohoo and it is stunning. I love it so much. I love this tie-dye effect and also my favourite part is the back. Like how nice is that? All the writing down the back, I think it's just such a cool look. And I just think you can wear these separately or you can wear them together. And I love this shade of purple and also like I love the way the hood sits around my neck. And it's such a good length of shorts as well. It's so soft on the inside. And it's just so comfy and slouchy. And I just think it's such an easy look as well. And like, how gorgeous is this together? I love it. So this next item is this California West Coast sweatshirt. And it's so silky soft on the inside. It's just stunning. I love it so much. It's so, so comfy and cosy. And I just think it's a really good quality of sweatshirt because some sweatshirts can, they're just not soft and you just, you want them soft, don't you? Like if it's a loungewear, if it's cosy, you want it soft. So yeah, I'm, I'm obsessed. I think this is gorgeous. I like that it's, you can have it quite long as well, or as I would wear it, I'll just like roll it up and it still sits like that. Like I just think it's still really nice. I love this shade of beige at the moment. I think it looks really nice. And I also feel like it looks good with my blonde hair. I think it goes well together. So yeah, this is like one of my favorite colors at the moment. So the last two items I thought I'd put on together is this nice red hat. It's such a cute little beanie. And also I think it fits really nice as well. It's not a like an ugly shape on my head. I do quite like this. And, and then this black turtleneck. The only complaint I have about it is that the sleeves are baggy. I would have liked them to be nice and tight all the way up like the body is. But it is comfy and it's not a knitted material, so if you do want one that is more knitted, like I was kind of hoping this would have been knitted, but I should have read it online, it probably didn't say it was knitted. So this probably will be going back. But apart from it being a bit baggy, it is comfortable, it's not itchy on the neck, anything like that, it is loads, like plenty of room. And yeah, I do think it is really cute. And the way I would style this red hat is just with a black turtleneck, similar to this, but I'll probably get a tight one and then my black leggings and my white trainers and I just think that'd be so cute together. That's everything I have for you today. Please let me know down in the comments which was your favourite piece out of this haul and I'll see you next time. Bye!